What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It is me and they call me Heat. You know, we back today cooking up another beat. Man, this one's gonna be smooth today. Um, I found this really dope sample pack that I purchased. It's got some really cool sounds in it. I wanted to take one of the loops that I found and chop it up and see what I can make of it, see what I could do with it. And hopefully you guys like it. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter. Uh, Instagram at they call me Heat. Twitter at underscore they call me heat and then facebook.com slash they call me heat or just search producer young heat on Facebook make sure you guys follow me on there as well like the page let me know what's up but anyway let's go ahead and get into the video I'll show you guys how I uh, cook up this uh, smooth hip-hop beat right here all right let's go all right so this is the sample that I found um, it's called it's from Pelham and junior young old soul composition pack um, number six and this is what the actual um, sample sounds like <laughs> So that's the sample that I used that I found and I, I like chopped it up already, kind of got it um, pitched down before I added the drums to it. And this is what it sounds like after I like threw it in an FL slicer or whatever. So I pitched it down, of course, went down to about 200 because I liked where it sounded at, where it sounds at 200. So I'm gonna drop some drums, you know what I'm saying? See what it sounds like with the drums. So we got the kick laid down. Next I'm gonna drop that, drop the snare in. So what I did off camera was I added just a little extra snare hits um, in the snare. I laid the normal, you know, as you saw, the, the normal just one hit. And then I went back in and heard a couple extra little hits that I liked. So it came out sounding like this. And then also I did add like a little velocity on it. Um, lowered the velocity on the first hit. So it doesn't hit so strong. And then I kind of took it off, you know, kilter, took it off time a little bit. Like I said, so it doesn't hit so strong. So next I'm going to go add in um, the open hi-hat on top of the, the snares. And I found this dope loop searching for more sound, just kind of percussion sound. Really dope, right? So I'm gonna drop it in and see what it sounds like with the actual beat. Dope, really dope, right? I really love that. So now I do feel like I'm gonna put that little hi hat in there, but I'm, you know, you know how I do. I'm not quantizing this whatsoever, okay? Them drums, boy. Them drums got a smack, I'm telling you. So next I'm gonna drop the sample in, see what, you know, see how it fits with the actual drums, all right?
All right, so what I did off camera again, because I don't like to take too much time fixing notes and changing notes. I had an idea and just wanted to kind of add little extra hits in there and then do a little slide, bass slide in there as well. So I don't know if I'm going to stick with that bass slide, uh, but y'all tell me what y'all think in the comments. All right, let's check it out. Thing that I did want to do which I did off camera because I don't know why I didn't hit record <laughs> so I added this uh, this sound from lush right here I need to go grab that lush but anyway it's not anything that I'm gonna lock in and really stick with but I think that um, it added a nice little flair to the track so I'm gonna let you guys hear it um, and see what you think all right drop me a comment and let me know That's it. Honestly, I really don't know who I would hear on this beat. I don't think I, I don't know who I hear yet. I hear maybe Kendrick, Kendrick or something, but I don't know. Nipsey Hustle. I don't really know. If y'all have an idea, let me know in the comments below of who you think uh, would be dope on this beat. Cause I really don't have an idea of who would sound good on it. I just know that the beat sounds really good to me. Sounds pretty full because the sample already has a lot going on in it, and I don't want to add too much. So, you know how I do. I like to keep it simple, just to you know what I'm saying, give the artist some room to shine. Feel me? So let me know. Give this video a thumbs up if you're liking this. Make sure you subscribe and hit that bell button as well right after so you don't miss any more of these videos. And uh, until next time, y'all, peace.